As the sun rises over Little Big Planet, we are made witness to glistening landscapes, rolling buffalo, ferociously frozen beasties, and, and whatever those things are. And at the center of this complex crafter ecosystem, we will find one of nature's most interesting and sack-like of creatures, the aptly named Sack Boy. A fully grown Sack Boy is a bit of a squirt at eight centimeters high. He overcomes his tininess by employing his opposable thumbs, or grabbing the heads of the cheetahs, because bold as they are, Sack Boys rarely think things through. The sack boy greets each day with vim, vigor, and verticality, and treats his environment as his own personal playground. Whilst sometimes, the environment tends to treat sack boy as its latest victim. The sack boy, unless we not forget sack girls, are adventurous and not prone to distraction. They are devoted to a perennial march to the right. They're also masters of verticality. What is the secret of their jumping skills? timing, mastering momentum, and being very careful not to leap when one should hop, and vice versa. A perfectly executed jump is an impressive achievement, and it'll often prompt the sack boy to engage in his traditional shaking of its posterior. Perhaps the most remarkable thing about the wily sack boys and sack girls is their ability to drastically alter their appearance. They do this willingly, in an effort to stay on the cutting edge of sack fashion. What a fit in it, Marty Raw. Once night falls on Little Big Planet, out come the creatures that make Sack Boy nervous. At any moment, he can come face to face with these natural predators. Usually recognized by the googly eyes, the tendency to want Sack Boy killed. The Sack Boy has good reason to be wary. If provoked, these creatures can easily inflict a mortal wound. But each one has an Achilles heel, an external brain. It should be targeted and crushed. Yes, patience pays off, and this round goes to Sack Boy. When they aren't acting out, Sack Boys and Sack Girls are always acting up, and perhaps it's simply because they can. After all, Little Big Planet belongs to the Sack people, leaving their mark wherever they go. On our next visit to Little Big Planet, we take a closer look at the cooperation and competition present in packs of sack boys. Till then, play nice.